Well, this is pretty cool. Uh, you may know I've been complaining about my wind instrument for a while. I like the fact that it's wireless and I don't have any wires in the mast and all that, but this receiver doesn't have any connectivity or functionality. When you try to look at true wind, of course, it has no source for true wind. I think maybe it's supposed to be, I, I don't know if it's supposed to talk to other wireless like through hole speed things or what, but it doesn't work. I don't have any of those. I have a nice chart plotter <clears throat> that up until recently, up until recently, it looked just like this. No wind information. You could get GPS speed from the chart plotter, but that's it. And uh, that was just really, really frustrating to me that I couldn't figure out how to get wind information on my chart plotter. Well, thanks to a guy who I don't know, um, but talked to him on a sailing forum, and he said, hey, this little Ray Marine device works pretty cool, and he had a couple extra ones, and he sent me one. There, I just turned on the wind instrument again. Uh, so now I'm getting my signal. Uh, anyway, so he sent it to me. It's a little Raymarine device or tactic device for NEMA uh, 0183. And apparently it can read a wireless signal from the wind instrument, I guess. Although I'm not sure why this, when you turn off the uh, Micronet head, I lose that, so I don't know how those are connected exactly. But anyway, to make a long story short, I monkeyed it around with it again. I tried it once before, tried wiring it up and just couldn't get it to work. Um, gave it another try today, and lo and behold, I got wind speed here. Uh, I don't know about the rest of it. I'm not sure what the 63 degrees is. I guess that's the true wind and the P is port maybe I don't I don't know um, we'll see when I tack if it changes to an S or something but anyway so I can show true wind and I can also show apparent wind the apparent wind matches pretty closely with my tactic uh, display <coughs> and uh, I can also then see my my true wind speed, which I never could see before. So I'm just excited about that. And then to top it off, I put another set of wires into my Raymarine autopilot, which also uh, could not steer to a wind uh, direction because it didn't have wind and I hooked up a second set of wires from that device to the NEMA in on the autopilot and lo and behold we now have the ability to hold the wind angle as well so that is cool I got to get a hold of that guy and let him know it worked and offer to pay him for the device uh, because it's quite exciting to have wind not only wind on my little device but wind here and, and importantly wind on the autopilot so this is the uh this is the mystery box here tactic wireless interface um so it's used i bought it from a guy uh, on a sailboat forum and basically you got power coming up power coming in it's reading the wind signal from the tactic wireless device and then I'm feeding it out to both my autopilot and to the Garmin chart plotter so I got to clean up the wiring here this was just testing it but now that it actually is working I'll mount it properly and um, 
and do the wiring a bit better. But the cool thing is it works. So that is the Tactic Wireless Interface.